And now joining me, San Diego State head coach Steve Fisher. The Aztecs will take on New Mexico State in a four verse, excuse me, yeah, a four seed for the Aztecs. Uh, Steve, a little bit of reaction here. There was a little bit of a buzz that you guys got a four seed and New Mexico, which beat you in that Mountain West Conference title game, got a seven. What was your reaction to that? Well, I was uh, expecting and appreciative that we got a four and not worry too much about what New Mexico got. So uh, you told me they got a seven. I really didn't know what they got. Uh, two good teams, um, and we are just excited that we're a four seed heading to Spokane and staying in the western region. Now, New Mexico State's got some size. They can play a little wild at times. What do you think about this matchup? They're huge. The seven foot five guy is a mammoth. So we'll have our hands full and they throw the ball inside. They're like us. They make more free throws than their opponent shoots. So we'll have to do a good job there. And I think you know Marvin Menzies and I, Marvin was my first hire on my first staff at San Diego State and Eric Sanders was one of my first recruits and Eric is an assistant for him. So there'll be a San Diego, San Diego State connection on that New Mexico State bench. That's right. Marvelous Marvin Menzies. All right. So last year, you guys were upset by Florida Gulf Coast in the NCAA tournament. There are some core guys, obviously, that have returned. And now that you're in the NCAA tournament, how much has that been a little bit of a motivating factor going forward? I don't know how much of a motivating factor. Uh, we want to win. We're like everybody. We want to go and win two games and be playing a week from now, preparing to play a week from now, home in Anaheim. In order to do that, we've got to get New Mexico State first and then see who's waiting in the wings. Uh, obviously, Florida Gulf Coast was the story last year when they got to the Sweet 16 as a 15 seed. Uh, they beat us along the way, also beat Georgetown, who I think was a number two or three seed. Steve, defense has never been a problem for this group this season. There have been stretches where you guys have been a little bit offensively challenged. How do you solve that here in the NCAA tournament? Well, you're being kind. You're right. If we make shots, we're hard for anybody to beat. Uh, we sometimes have a hard, a hard time making perimeter shots. So we just have to continue to play, and uh, we have to. We have found ways, Andy, to win. Uh, we're the number one team in America for getting to the free throw line, shooting free throws as opposed to our opponent. We've been able to guard and not foul, and we've been able to get ourselves to the free throw line. So. We found different ways to score. You look at that statistically and you say, well, you know, they don't shoot it well. But we find ways when we need a basket, if whether it's make one at the, a timely basket or get to the free throw line and make free throws. Well, Steve, we appreciate it. Good luck in your matchup against New Mexico State out in Spokane. Thank you. Thank you, Andy. Appreciate it.